All right, in this video, we're going to talk about how to use the text tool. Now, right now, I want to point out that I'm not in the sketch mode. In fact, I'm in the modeling mode, which is why I have my three-dimensional modeling tools. And you'll notice that there is no text function. To make text, you must be in a sketch. Now, to get started here, I have kind of this name tag sort of shape, um, as if it were going to go on a desk. And I want to go ahead and put my name on the front of this name tag. So I'm going to click on the face that I want to put my name on, right click and say new sketch. I'm going to name this text and then sort of change my view here. So I'm looking right at that face. Now you'll notice that there is a text tool. I can go ahead and click on the text tool and drag sort of a text box where I want my text to go and type in whatever it is that you're looking to type. There's, of course, options to make it bold. There are some fonts, not so many. The reason that you're kind of limited on fonts here is because oftentimes when you 3D print or make three-dimensional models, it's difficult to create complicated fonts. So go ahead and just kind of flip through and find a font that you like. And then hit the checkbox when you'd like. Now, my name is a little bit longer than it can be for this height. So if I wanted to, I could actually go ahead and use the dimension tools to actually change the size of my text here. So if I were to click between the two ends, I can actually specify the length. So I don't know, let's go with seven inches, see how that looks. Uh, it's a little bit smaller than I want. Let's try eight, mm, too much, 7.5, perfect. And then I wanna actually use my transform tool to move my text so I can kind of move it and center it on my name tag here and double click. So I now have my text on my name tag. Now, if I were to leave the text by hitting, or leave my sketch by hitting the green checkbox, I can actually edit the text as though it were any regular sketch. So if I were to grab my extrude tool, I can select my text profile and either extrude it to be three dimensions, kind of standing out of the name tag like so. I'm gonna pull it in a little bit, it's a little bit too much. Or I could actually do a remove function and cut into the name tag um, and kind of embed the text into the name tag. So if I hit the checkbox, you'll see I just went ahead and I cut my name into this desk name tag.